Hey everyone, Chrissy from GoZips.com. Welcome to James A. Rhodes Arena, where Zips men's basketball has just defeated Detroit with a final score of 79 to 60. The first 20 minutes came as a challenge to the Zips as they were down 30 to 21 heading into halftime. Akron came out a brand new team starting the second half with a nine point run to tie the game at 30 and never looked back. Demetrius Treadwell led all players in scoring with 22 points, followed by Niles Evans with 17. Let's go to head coach Keith Dambrot for his thoughts on tonight's game. I said, look, we, we were uh, 6 of 26. We were 7 of 13 at the line, I think, right? I said, we can't play any worse. We just got to play with some energy. I said, you know, I'm not going to yell at screen match. I said, this will be a good test for you because we're going to be down in other games throughout the season. And we just going to have to gut it out. And, uh, you know, we got great performances in the, in the first half. Tree kept us in it. He was terrific. And in the second half, Evans and Diggs, Diggs was really good. And then Evans made every shot. And then Kretzer hit a couple of bombs. And you know, it's a double-edged sword. You know, we have some ball handling weakness at times. And if people choose to press us, then they're going to give up some three balls, right? So it's a, it's a, it's a, that pressing is a double-edged sword, which we, we press too, so I know. But you know, when teams can shoot it, you know, we got a lot of open looks in the second half. I thought our guys did a really terrific job of, uh, of finding the extra, the, the open man and making the extra pass. Did you say the Well, you know, we have good opportunity now. Look, we, you know, we're seven games in. We've played four home games, three road games. We're playing, we're starting to play a little bit better. I don't think we're maxed out by any means. Now we have the opportunity to go on a neutral court and play some good teams. And then we got an opportunity to go to South Carolina and play another good team. And so we have, we have some good opportunities ahead for us if we can play well. So if we can get the first one, which won't be easy, then we'll probably get an opportunity to play Iowa State, who is similar to how I would view Oklahoma State last year, which is a great opportunity for our team. So you know, I'm not looking past Oregon State's going to be hard. They're humongous. You know, and they're going to play 1-3-1 one, one zone and all kinds of crazy stuff. So. You know, we're good when we're comfortable. And when we're a little uncomfortable, we're not so good. But you can see us getting a little bit better. You know, a little inconsistent. So like they're, they're, they're trying to test my nerves all the time. But you know, we, we, as long as we share the ball and we try, I can live with some of the, the popcorn man passes. Tonight has wrapped up the Zips homestand as they will now head to Honolulu for the Hawaiian Airlines Diamond Head Classic December 22nd, 23rd, and 25th. Akron will not return to their home court until Tuesday, December 31st as they will play host to Coppin State, tip-off set for 6 p.m. For ticket information, call 1-888-99-ACKERN or visit ZipsTickets.com.